hey crafters it's your girl again with another video today's video is going to be totally different from what you guys are used to today's video i'm going to be helping you guys get sales make sales and know how to use um know how to understand etsy algorithm i have um excuse my tongue my tongue is blue because i had lollipop so but anyways so just to give you a background i am new to etsy i'm not like um like the big stores i am just getting to understand how etsy algorithm works and um etsy has been in my favor lately and my business is growing lately and i'm grateful to god and i'm like i have to share what i have been doing that my business have been growing for those of you that are new to etsy or that you're a beginner um, I, I just thought I should, you know, help you guys because you, our stores are not like the huge stores out there. Um, my store is little, just like yours, so you'll be able to um, relate. I'll be able to relate with you and you'll be able to relate. But right now, things have really changed for me and I have been doing some stuff that I, I have been doing. Four things that has really helped me out. It's actually four to six stuff that has really helped me out. So uh, make sure you watch to the end because I'm going to share the most important thing that is going to help you grow your Etsy store. So for those of you for those of you that don't know what Etsy is, Etsy is a platform where buyers and sellers come together to transact business so etsy is basically a marketplace for crafters if you are make hand if you usually make like handmade stuff like tutus that i make behind me t-shirts whatever you craft whatever you're doing whatever craft you're into etsy is a great place to sell all your stuff so this video is gonna really help you guys out so make sure you watch it till the end so let's just get into it the next time i'm gonna make a video i'm gonna share my screen so you guys can really see but today i'm just going to tell you all the things i have been doing that have helped me grow my business so i hope this is gonna help you guys out one thing that is definitely gonna help you is for you to understand um how to post your your items on etsy so understand how to post it your tags and also your your what they call it now your description um you have to I'll, I'll have to do a video on that because that will make a huge difference for you so you want to make sure when you are tagging and when you are uh, putting a description especially your first um the first thing that comes on your description you want to be related to what your product is about so if i'm making a mickey mouse or Minnie mouse tutu i'm gonna make sure that the first thing that is gonna appear is gonna be what that tutu is about so and also your tags you want to make sure that you expand on your tags you just don't want to you know be using just one kind of tag like mickey mouse Minnie mouse you know you you put like yellow tutu pink tutu you know you just be you just gotta you know be um creative on that aspect because that's gonna help you out like um for this sunflower tutu that i have behind me um when putting on the description i can uh, not the description but the title is it the title they call it um i can put sunflower tutu and um put whatever you want to make sure you use all the words that is given to you you don't want to leave nothing behind and uh in your description you want to put something whatever you have on your title you want to make sure that you put all of that stuff in your description put it in a sentence do whatever you need to do to make sure you have that in your description and also your tag you expand your tag by putting something different so that you can have more reach so i'm not gonna touch more on that but if you guys want me to talk more on that that is a topic on its own and it's a huge um topic it can it can change your business drastically so um but i'm not gonna go into that so the number two things i have my notes here so if you see my eyes going back and forth i am reading my notes so the number two thing is to make sure that you are adding products on a uh, on a regular basis frequently add products you don't want to have few items on your on your store you want to have more so um the tips i'm gonna give you is um if you even need to like um 
uh, copy your listing and change the picture and kind of tweak tweak your title do that as long as you are active on your etsy store etsy is gonna i have um sorry i just got a message from a customer from etsy so i'm looking at the message so as long as you are active on your etsy store etsy is gonna take you serious so the algorithm is gonna be in your favor so you have to be active on etsy you cannot like just put 10 items in your store and just want to sit down you, you cannot sit down and just you cannot put just 10 items or whatever items a number of items and sit down and watch etsy perform its magic you have to do the work there's a lot of work that um this whole thing is involved so you have to do your work so um like i was telling you guys um add more products however you want to do it do it change pictures tweak things up and make sure you have your active or active on etsy on a daily basis that's gonna change your business trust me i'm speaking by example because this uh this is what i did that really helped me out the number three stuff that i have on my list is offer free shipping yes that would change things up for you people love free shipping um for me i love sh free shipping whatever store i'm buying i'm buying stuff from and when i see free shipping guess what i'm buying from them like when i was buying my tutu um the tool like the tool that i use for my tutu um i had a store that was giving free shipping and i had a store that wasn't giving free shipping guess what the store that was giving free shipping the amount was higher the store that wasn't giving free shipping the amount was lower and that um kind of captured my attention i did not go for the one that was cheap out i went for the one that had the free shipping because i wanted the free shipping so what am i trying to say is when you want to offer free shipping to your customers put that money back in their cost they don't know that it is there people don't care people just want the free shipping they rather go for something that is more higher expensive they'll think it's high quality and it has free shipping so you want to make sure you put in your cost of shipping in your product that you're selling so that the customer will pay for the shipping without knowing so offer free shipping in your store make sure your, your store is a free shipping store you're gonna get sales the last thing on my list and that is the most important thing is gonna be make sure you're running sales sales has really changed my business for me and guess what you can actually hide that amount in um that item in your cost without the customers knowing so it's like you're adding back like let's assume they're getting five dollars or six dollars off from my five percent on on a hundred dollars or on a ninety dollars item and uh, i just add that amount back and they will not even feel it they won't even know that that is not actually a sale that is the actual amount so you can literally add that amount to your cost and you're not gonna feel it so sales has really changed my business i always have sales and let me tell you a trick when adding sales make sure you make it one day one day sale and it usually gives them a notification it gives them like a notification that you have whatever hours left um on this sale on this item the sale it usually give them like um like a timing on when their sale is gonna end so don't make your sale like um a sale that is gonna stay forever make sure your sale is something that is gonna end especially 24 hour sale is all what i always do make sure you have a 24 hour sale because people when they see that timer they tend to like want to buy immediately so they don't miss out on the sale so that's that's my trick for you so make sure you do that i have one bonus for you guys so the bonus that i have for you guys that is gonna definitely help your sale is on the quantity part put two or three that's what i do i put two i put three because it gives them a notification that this item is um low in stock so order now so that triggers the customer to want to buy because they don't want to miss 
um, that they don't want to miss because they don't want to miss out on it. So they quickly tend to buy, they, they tend to buy right away. So those are the tricks that I have been doing that has been giving me sales on Etsy. So try those, um, these five tricks. I know I told you guys four, but the last one is a bonus for those of you that actually waited till the end. So, um, Try let me know in the comment section if that is that has helped you guys. And if you guys are going to try, let me know. All right, guys. I hope this was helpful. And um, I know this is not our usual videos. But um, it's not just all about making stuff, creating, making tutus, making t-shirts. Um, you have to get it to the end um, users, which is the customers. So that's the reason why I thought I should just bring up this video to help you guys. So I have finally figured out how to get sales on Etsy because Etsy, you have a lot of competitors on there. So you have to bring in your best foot in and make sure you kill it. So, um, so that other customers can see you and like your products rather than the other person's products. So you have to do, uh, you have to work hard. It's not something that, um, you can just, um, you, you cannot just sit down and fold your hands. You have to put in the work. There's a lot of work involved, but guess what? The end result is going to be beneficial because you are, um, helping your business grow. And when your business grow, then, um, things are gonna, you know, fall in place for you. So, um, I hope this was helpful. Let me know in the comment section if you guys like videos like this. If you like videos like this, give me thumbs up so that that way I can bring more videos like this to help your business grow. Not just making tutus. You guys already know how to make tutus. You guys know how to make t-shirts. So I thought, you know, the best thing um, to do is to help you guys know how to get sales. Because that's the main thing. Because making all of this and sitting without selling them is not, the good, is not a good thing at all. So I can show you guys my screen so you guys can see. I have some orders sitting down for me to um, process. And um, let me show you. I'm going to have to manually show you guys my screen so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So it don't seem like I'm just talking. But I'm going to show you some numbers so you guys can see real quick before we go. So this is my Etsy store. Some of you know my Etsy store. Some of you don't. And... Um, but anyways, these are my Etsy stores. You see what I was talking about? Um, getting your business um, with a lot of items. Even if you do not have um, more products, you can copy the uh, product and kind of change things up. So um, that so that way, Etsy can see that you are busy and it can promote your business. It can put your business forward. So that's the reason why you see double because that's... Um, just what i always do if i realize that i haven't done nothing um i haven't like made new items i just like duplicate so that's what i was talking about so let's get into my dashboard where you guys are going to be seeing some numbers so i am going to click on let's click on for this month what i have made or let's see last month no, let's do, let's do this month. So this month, you guys can see my total. Oops, you guys are not seeing it. Sorry. You guys can see my total view. So I'm getting um, traffic in my stores. My total view is 1,804. And this is um, the uh, month of April. And you guys see the dates. Today's dates. You can see the dates. Sorry. 4, 8. And um, I'm just moving my... my 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 camera so you guys can see how many visits out of this 1800 i got 815 visits so that is beautiful so i got this view much view and this visit people that visited my store after viewing they came to my store to see what's going on and i got 12 orders and today is the 8th of april and i already got 12 orders and you guys can see what i made so far this month 564 dollars so far so um i'm gonna show you yesterday the last seven days actually last seven days um well <laughs> when i say last seven days um uh, today is the eighth so it's just one day difference so this does not really make many sense let me show you guys yesterday so yesterday i had 356 um views i got 142 um visits to my store 
and i got four orders yesterday i made 218 dollars just yesterday so i am so excited because things are working in my favor like i told you guys and let me go to these statistics so you guys can see what i made last month and this is for today today i got one order and so far and it is let me show you for last month if i can get let me go to custom custom and from let's go backwards march march is when i started seeing difference in my store in 31st and we're gonna apply so you guys can see what i made last month so i got 2145 visits and i got 23 orders and my conversion conversion rate is 1.5 percent and you guys can see my revenue that i made one thousand six hundred and thirty four dollars and seventy cents so you guys can see my numbers i'm not playing when i started um let me show you guys all you know i might as well just show you guys last year when i started you guys can see that my visits i still had some visits these two orders you see three dollars those were me coming so i was the one in this part trying to be my customer so that's why i said there are different tricks for you to um get sales so i'm gonna teach you guys that later sometime so the month of january um i'm gonna show it to you guys and uh oh i'm gonna so guys you guys can see the month of january um i'm gonna Let's see, did I get this right? January, this one is supposed to be January 2023. Because I did not have a store 2022. That's why it was giving me an error here. And we're going to apply. So this was when my I started getting sales. I got two sales. Um, right, did I? I think this was um, a sale from someone that i know so i don't consider this a sale <laughs> i don't think this this i'm not gonna consider as a sale because it was from somebody that i know and um we are gonna go to the month of march and uh, not Mar march but um february february was when i started actually seeing sales but march was mind-blowing so there we go that's february i'm gonna put this up now i started this was when i got my um, first sale for real for real on etsy from somebody that i do not know so when i say be your own customer those other months where people that i know and myself went behind to you know purchase so i'll have to teach you guys all of those tricks because that can help you out so but anyways i got 141 visits and two orders 1.4 well, four percent conversion rate in my revenue for february was 175 dollars and i was a happy camper i was so happy you're like no kidding so and this actually did not happen until probably close to the end of february and it started kicking up so that was because i was running i started running sales when I realized I was running sales and it was in my favor, I'm like, oh, okay. The month of March, I started getting serious with it. And I started running sales for real. Every day, every weekend, I try to run sales. And right now, I got sales going on. So this is the month of March here. And you guys already seen that. And this was when I really did really, really good. And now, so far, so good. Um, This month... I am looking good already. Look at that. I got 12 orders, 815 um, visits, 1.5 conversion, and now uh, $564.50. So this is good so far. So you guys, I just wanted to show you guys that this has worked out for me and it can work out for you if only you understand the algorithm, if you do exactly what I told you guys to do so i hope this was um helpful i hope you guys are gonna implement all of these things that i just taught you guys you guys have seen my numbers i'm not kidding i'm not lying i'm not trying to shoot off videos for you guys i am trying to help you guys 100 percent grow because you guys seen how my whole 
um life of my business is like when i started i was my biz i was my customer and um january i had family member bought something from me i don't consider that as organic uh, traffic um but in the month of february was when i started getting sales and last month honey i killed it like i was so excited and this month we are already on just on the eighth of this month and I already made a lot of money already i'm like whoa so um you guys let me know what you think about this video if you, this is the kind of videos you like give me thumbs up so that way i can produce more videos for you guys to help your business grow and to get more sales as well well thank you guys for watching thank you for hanging with me i hope this was helpful i hope you're gonna implement this and let me know in the comment section as always stay positive work hard and let's all make it happen Bye-bye.